Hey everybody, what is up, Proptos here? So, we had a bit of technical difficulties. Basically, uh, the whole last recording session that I did of this game, uh, basically, for some reason, like, basically my whole computer just crashed, so I basically kind of lost all the stuff I recorded last time, and I didn't upload any of it. Yeah, smart me. But anyway, so yeah, we're basically... I basically had to go to the part where I left off on episode 1, and we're back here recording it again. So for this time, we won't have any technical difficulties. I know last time we had some weird issues that, for some reason, the game decided to go black on the screen. I had to press pause real quick in order to get the video to come back, so hopefully that won't continue. That would kind of suck, but who knows, we'll see. I think it should go alright. Have all these lovely tutorials that we have to do. What? I could sit there and... Wow, did you see that? I just evaded using the touchscreen. I'm gonna play the whole game like this. Oh my god, this is amazing. Look at this. Look at this. Holy shit. Yeah, I'm just joking. I would not play the game like this. I don't even know if you can attack with the touchscreen. I think it's only used for, like, running and evading, which I really don't see any practical use for that, but whatever. I guess it's like, oh, I gotta use a touchscreen somehow, so fuck it. I guess we'll just do this. You can move around with it. It's kind of neat. Ah, let's go kick some angel ass. Bring up that chest. Come on. I got Halos. Okay, Sonic Rings. Whatever. Come on, I just thought you guys were tough shit. What's going on? Oh, can't leave those Halos behind. Need to buy Nintendo costumes with those. Or new weapons. Most likely new weapons, but yeah. Of course, still need to figure out how to hell the freaking uh, was it use them in the actual gameplay. I'm kind of curious if you need to actually beat the game first in order to actually use them, or that you can use them in your first playthrough. I'm assuming you'd have to beat the game first. I should probably test that on Bayonetta 2 since I've already beaten that twice. Touch and hold. Oh, apparently I can attack with that too. Well, that's neat, I guess. Rotate L and press X or A. Okay. Beautiful. Now I'll do that. Oh yeah. Fetch please, like you're gonna fucking hit this. Alright, and we totally just had that weird fucking glitch again. I don't know why it only does this with Bayonetta 1. But yeah, I don't know if that actually shows up in the video or not. Luckily it doesn't affect the recording, it didn't reaffect the video last time, so I don't know, we'll see. It's just a slight annoyance. Which I really don't get to, because ba recording Bayonetta 1, that didn't happen like once. And then all of a sudden, only with this game, it freaking happens like constantly. Well, not constantly, but just kind of here and there. But hopefully the game won't be an ass and keep doing it. And of course Enzo gets kidnapped. What are the odds? Oh, oh I missed my halos. Can I break these good halos? Or am I just vandalizing a graveyard? Kinda wanna think I'm just vandalizing a graveyard, but no, it doesn't fucking matter because I'm fucking being it and I can do whatever the heck I got. Dang, what? Tiger, what? Ah, see, there were halos in the grave zones. Well, see, I was only looking for halos. I was trying to vandalize the graveyard. I would never do such a horrendous thing. Cough, cough. Okay. Let's go save Enzo. Oh, and we just crushed his car. <laughs> She's like, whoops. Damn it, who did that? I just bought the damn thing. Um, it was one of the angels. The angels did it, yeah. 
Those pesky angels, how dare they. Haven't you figured it out yet? There's no quarter for you in this world. Okay, never mind, she just doesn't give a shit. Oh, we could have easily blamed on the angels. She's like, no, no, screw you, Enzo, you're not important in this world. Yeah, I know you had a nice car, but... Psh, yeah, I don't care. Damn, what the fuck? Wait, did I just dodge that? Do something, bitch. There we go, that's what I was trying to do. The last time I was doing this, I thought the freaking life bar gauge was for the car. I was like, wait, no, that was for the bigger enemy. Silly me. Yeah, we got to go! I know, right? She probably does it, but then again, she honestly probably doesn't care. Engine still purrs nicely. Now, about this little thing you've been looking into for me. Seriously, I really don't know why this game is having so many issues with the video. See, this is why I told you I was going home. I just got held up in the air by some invisible things, and you want an intelligence briefing? It never stops with you. <laughs> you keep belly aching like that, and you're liable to wake Eggman from the dead. And I don't think either of you would like that. Uh, Catch your leg. Like what? The really? Really now? You're gonna need a rush on our special project before the shit hits the fan. Wait, Rodan. What about? Eggman, such a popular chap. I bet they hate him down there as much as you did when he was up here. We just need to make sure he won't come crawling back when they kick him out. Nothing a flower bed can't fix. Fill her up. That means you, Enzo. You heard the man. Finish up in five minutes or you're walking home to your cake and candles. What? Don't you leave me here? And I still don't know why I'm having so many issues. It really sucks too because I can't just restart the recording because I kind of had to leave off at a specific cutscene. I really don't feel like we're rewatching the cutscene again. Okay, let's just hope this isn't a constant freaking problem in the game. Really, the steering wheel? Oh, I guess at least it still works. Kind of. When you end up in the afterlife, that's not going to be pretty. I can't help it if I like the little outfits. The toys are nice too. Twenty years ago, you woke up stuck in a casket at the bottom of a lake. All you can remember. Because his hubcaps are just falling off. You gotta sacrifice our halo wearing friends every day, or they'll drag your ass back down to hell. I know I thought I got screwed, but being forced to slap around the divine for a living, that's really getting screwed. If I needed a biographer, you wouldn't be my first choice. I see to the funeral, you get me the information I asked for. That was our deal. <laughs> Come on now! Look at my poor car! I'm working for free after this! At least let me get a drink at Rodan before you start drilling me. The info I got is good. It's gonna get you close to finding the other stone in the pair. 
and figuring out some of that lost past of yours. I swear. <laughs> After jewels instead of cash, just like a girl. <laughs> Jesus, can't you take a joke? Enzo, someone's given you a present. Too bad. I can't stand bugs. That well, probably already means it's already too late by now. What the fuck? The fuck? Oh shit. And there goes his car, and being further damaged. I'll just buy a new car after that. Oh look, it's John. Of course, in this part of the game, she's a total enemy, but whatever. Actually, most of the game, she's a complete enemy. Also, kind of a pain in the ass to handle, too. Of course, they're gonna do some other crappy pistols, but whatever. Perfect butterfly. Torture attacks. And bam goes the dynamite. Oh, it's another gold metal. So frickin' fabulous, dear good lord. Look at that shit. Boom, fabulous, fabulous. Fabulous, that's a capital F. <laughs> Alright, and we are running into that stupid freaking glitch again, I don't know why. Whatever, we'll deal with it with this video, or this recording session, then I guess next time I'll be looking into exactly what could be causing it. Possibly I'm assuming something in my settings? Because I want to set up the hodgepodge, not hodgepodge, blah, HDPPR2, same thing actually. Anyways, what I was trying to say when I was doing the settings, I set up for 360, PS3, PS4, Xbox One. But then for some reason Wii U was set up the PC, so maybe I need to set it for the Wii U in order to get it to record properly? I don't know. You don't say. It's getting harder and harder to tell the worlds apart. Human world. 